wow, what a life, what a world we're living in, what majestic transformations we're going through, what a strange place to be at. And it feels like home at the same time, because we're part of nature. I've just realized that nothing, we don't have free will. I just come to the conclusion we have, don't have free will, because we're part of nature. Nothing in nature has free will. <laughs> Everything is already in a big plan, and it's always it's already been that since the Big Bang, so I admit my mistakes. Anyway. Wow. Traveling. What a... What a hobby. <laughs> what a lifestyle. How long can I do this? How long do you think I can do this? I've been doing this for two and a half years. I think I can do it for a long time. Six years? Eight? Ten? Eleven? 13? I don't know. And I, it doesn't matter. Maybe it's just one year. I have no idea. And honestly, it doesn't matter because the universe already has a plan. And I don't have to think about it. I don't have to worry about it. I don't have to do anything. I can just be. And obviously we need to take action and we need to talk because that's how we, that's how we change our reality. But maybe that action that we take already was planned to take that day and the date and the time that you took it, that second. Because everything is down to seconds. Everything is down to seconds, milliseconds, even less probably. And we can notice that with like how close death and, and being alive can be, for example. Yeah. There's a lot of cleansing going on right now. We can do it, we're strong. We have each other. Whether, whether we are in human form or in spirit form, we always have each other. It doesn't matter if we are still alive or not. We were alive before and we will still remember our names. Maybe not all of them, there's a lot of names. But we do remember the people who changed the world. And we do remember the people who changed themselves. And we do remember everyone, if they've been in our lives. So basically everyone remembers everyone, because there's no one in this life that's been totally alone their whole life, because they were born from a mother, right? And then maybe they were like abandoned. That's horrible, like forever. But I mean, there should be some kindness in the world, right? So I honestly, and I really hope that every human being has experienced someone that has been kind. I really hope that some everyone has had one experience with some with some kindness. Isn't it beautiful though that we are part of everything from the beginning of time? And it doesn't matter what kind of life form we were, because <laughs> we've been developing since the beginning of time. Because in the beginning of time, we came from the same source. And since then we're all, we've just been developing and developing and developing and developing for millions of years. We were the dinosaurs. <laughs> Is that a title? I'm happy. I'm a bit, I'm not scared anymore, actually. I'm more excited. I just don't really look forward to uncomfortable feelings, but can't really do anything about that instead of just feeling them. Kinda easier to just feel them, right? So I'm just gonna do that. And it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be beautiful because I'm expressing myself. Whatever I want to express. And no reactions from emotions is a different thing than expressing our emotions, right? So when we're reacting from an emotional trigger or just an emotional state, then it's usually because we get, we get triggered by something someone says. It's a reaction. But when we're expressing, so it's not happening because of something or someone else, which is weird because everything happens because something or someone else. But yeah, it doesn't have to be negative. It doesn't have to be toxic. It can be 
progressing, it can be growing, it can be educational, it can be inspirational, inspirational, anal, in, in, in spiral anal, inspirational. <laughs> And yeah, I'm excited to show all the colors, because why hide? <laughs> it's just unnecessary. So hello, welcome to this YouTube channel. My name is Emily Robin. I do YouTube videos and I talk about shit here. And I travel around the world. I'm right now in Mexico, Oaxaca City. And I'm going to another city very soon. And then I'm going to Guatemala. And I'm excited. And even though I'm doing this changes on the outside, even though I'm changing place, I'm also changing from the inside because that's what traveling do. Whenever we come to a new place, a new location, there's a new energy field, there's new information to take up where we go, especially if we are going to a place we've never been to before. It's new information because we've never been there in our lifetime, but maybe in past lifetimes. So maybe we're traveling around to collect lost soul parts to heal ourselves, to heal our souls. Because maybe we've been, in, we've been wounded in our soul, souls and we need to retrieve those parts that we think that we have lost. But they were never really lost, we just neglected them, I would say. Because we can never lose ourselves. And even if we think we lose ourselves, we always find ourselves again. And it's usually a better version of ourselves when we find ourselves again. And this is what I do. I just talk about shit here. Sometimes I do music. Yeah. Press subscribe if you want to join my little adventures in this world while I'm talking about whatever going on in my mind. And press the like if you like this video. Write a comment. Do you think that we're the dino dinosaurs? Are we the dinosaurs from the past? That's a question. What do you think? What do you believe in? I accept all beliefs here because I think that truth is objective and we can believe whatever we want to believe. I believe in fairies and angels. I also believe in magical creatures and abilities that cannot be explained with our little magical, magical, sure, but logical mind. But our mind is also magical, it's true. It's a tool, it's just a matter of how we use it. Just with everything else that is a tool in life, right? Astrology, spirituality, numerology, psychoactive medicines, plants, Everything is a tool, but it's not the answer because you have the answer. The tool is just here to show you the answer, which is already within you. So that's kind of cool and have a beautiful day.